Okay, so today we're going to talk a little bit about the recent Martin Ford and Iranian Hulk drama. So Martin Ford has recently come out and said the reason behind the cancellation of the fight is due to concerns over the Iranian Hulk's mental health and he was legitimately concerned and worried that the Iranian Hulk might kill himself if the fight went ahead. And then the Iranian Hulk basically accused Martin Ford of taking steroids, being basically a steroid lifter. So this this drama is still going on, even though the fight's cancelled. Um, I have absolutely no doubt that the Iranian Hulk definitely has some sort of mental health issues. We've seen by the way he's acted, the popcorn drama, the bear hugging and trying to take down Martin Ford. Uh, his very weird social media posts of him training, uh, standing outside Martin Ford's hotel room with a bunch of uh, other slightly weird looking individuals. Um, just generally what he says online, his weird, weird photoshopped uh, images of him with big clown feet. Um, this guy is definitely has definitely got a couple of screws loose for sure. And we just see by some of his training footage here, it's just so fucking cringeworthy. It's so fake and it's just something who, some, it's just content that someone who's not quite there upstairs would post just a little bit mentally unstable um, it's just not how you train for boxing or weightlifting it's just what you do when you're a teenager and you want to be cool and you're clowning around in a basement uh, trying to be a tough guy it's so cringing I mean look at that what is he training for blowjobs what, what, what is wrong with this guy um, so anyway my personal opinion as to why the fight was cancelled is due to the fact it was a joke they weren't selling any tickets. Nobody took it seriously. Nobody wanted to watch it. It would have ended up just being a meme on social media. Uh, it would have been a career finisher for Martin Ford. He would have become the laughing stock of sport. Um, and, and those are the reasons. And everything about the Iranian Hulk is fake. We saw the Photoshop photos that he posted online before, many years ago. And then we saw in real life when he met Martin Ford at a showdown and he looked like a completely different individual <laughs> it was hilarious i thought it wasn't the same guy i thought that was his brother or assistant that came out to meet martin ford before they had a, a showdown i i didn't even know it was him nobody recognized him um so that's the reason for the cancellation of the fight uh and i wish they would just admit it if, instead of coming up with these stupid excuses but i guess there's just legal reasons why they're sticking to this storyline rather than the obvious one that the fight is a joke because the iranian hulk is a fake um so who do you think martin ford will fight next it's definitely not going to be this clown um i think it's he's going to have to do a rematch with eddie hall because he did say that if Eddie got the tattoo, tattoo, paid the money to Larry Wills, uh, agreed to the money, giving money to charity of, of, of Hafthor Bjornsson's choice, then he would, uh, he would agree to a rematch with Eddie Hall. And Eddie Hall has done all those things, so there should be a rematch between the two. But I think the next fight, a more entertaining fight, would be uh, Hafthor Julius Bjornsson versus Martin Ford. I think that would be a much better fight so anyway let me know what your thoughts are comment below please do i love to hear your opinion uh some people have got some great uh, insights out there and some interesting thoughts uh, share below give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it subscribe to the channel and have a great day